Hello guys and welcome to Marcel Entertainment. I'm about to check out PewDiePie's YouTube Rewind 2019 and it's actually good. How good is it though? How good? That's the big question right there. How good is the YouTube Rewind 2019 by PewDiePie? Okay, let's have a look at this one. And if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more content and likes and shares are also very, very much appreciated. All right, let's check this one out. Yeah. It's starting. In 2018, we made something that you didn't like. So in 2019, we made a top 10 Watch Mojo video. Oh, that will fix it. That actually might uh, fix a lot the Watch Mojos. Like really, maybe, maybe that's the solution. Let's find out. <laughs> I love the animation there in the headphone. Oof. You shouldn't try this at home. No, seriously. Like, you're not supposed to stand in the middle of the road listening to loud music and not turn around to see what's behind you. That's very dangerous. We are learning a lesson from this. <laughs> oh no, he has airports in. He can't hear it. Yeah, that's actually true. No, seriously, like, I actually know this one guy in my city and something almost happened to that person. He has these huge headphones, always walking around. And one time he didn't hear a car and... I mean, nothing happened, but almost, but yeah. <laughs> Me and the boys making me one. <laughs> oh shit, here we go again. Oh wow, that person just got rich, but seriously, he has an interesting remix right there. Like this uh, blowfish they're eating a carrot. <laughs> like this blowfish right there has probably the most memes out there on YouTube from all animals that are out there. I mean, there's also the bongo cat, right? But uh, this blowfish like went really, really viral. Like you can find so many memes with that one. That's so crazy right there. <laughs> Oh wow, okay. That's <laughs> one thing I really like here is like what was that? <laughs> like how that blowfish appears there. Number one, number one blowfish. <laughs> Like, okay. You did nothing wrong like starting your business by selling pirated songs. Okay, Boomer. Oh, some Naruto. Oh, wow. Oh, oh hey. Where's he? I did not go to bed. I know we couldn't Skype tonight, but that's alright. Good night, girl. I'll see you tomorrow. You oh, wow. Who is that uh, lucky woman that was about to Skype with him? <laughs> okay, she wasn't lucky, but... Oh, wow, like... Okay. That's terrifying, like... Skype tonight, but... That's alright. Good night, girl. I'll see you tomorrow. You have to die, you fucking dick! <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling you girl. I've never seen this before either. And I know how you must feel looking at this for the first time. It's so incredible, right? It's so unbelievable, right? <laughs> so Minecraft too. Bet you don't have this blue. Bet you don't have this green. Bet you don't have the biggest ball the world has seen. <laughs> yeah, that's also a really, really famous meme. This, this, this guy. Uh, like, 
I keep getting uh, those memes constantly sent by one of my friends. Like he's addicted to this uh, guy's memes. Like seriously, like each time I check my WhatsApp, I constantly get memes where this guy appears. Like it's just crazy. <laughs> That's the best this line ever. Like seriously, ten out of ten for this uh, this line. Then I mind your mom. So if you have a problem with someone and you want to just diss that person and and make that diss hurt a lot, right? Like then you just have to say, you know what? Shut up! I'm gonna mind your mom. <laughs> that must hurt, right? Uh, yes, yes. That's ninja. Hey Ninja, do you know Joe from Fortnite? I mean, that was one of the best questions I I've ever been asked. Uh, wow. <laughs> you were supposed to ask me who Joe is. <laughs> that was a good question indeed. Who is this mysterious Joe, that Fortnite player Joe? I feel like I've heard that name somewhere before. Joe of Fortnite. Let me think for a moment. Nope, I don't know who he is, but... Hmm, that's actually really a good question. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? <laughs> who is that guy? Marquez Brown. These cameras are the main focus for the iPhone 11 Pro. Oh, wow. Oh, shit! A spot! Oh wow, that was a special day right there, guys. That, that was when Kim Jong-un and Trump went to the movie theater to watch the new Avengers uh, movie that was just coming out. Like, oh wow, and that was so crazy. Like, that was a memorable day and Kim Jong-un and Trump will never forget this one. And we won't ever forget this one. And they were really liking the new Avenger movie. Like, wow. I'm the bald guy, bruh. No more. Skiss, skiss, skiss. Meme review. Tuck to film meme. Who is this guy? Elon Musk. Is some wannabe on a fence or something? I don't even know who this guy is. I feel like. Wait, is that. I actually feel like Dr. Phil, when he does like meme reviews, he does the most honest meme reviews and will really go deep with his th thoughts and he will say everything that he's really thinking and he won't hold back. Like, wow. Who this guy is. I feel like that. Wait, is that a real picture? Um, <laughs> what? Is that actually, that actually yeah. Check this out. Kino Rich. Oh, that's PewDiePie's uh, wedding. That was actually such a oh, beautiful Felix, wedding. I, I saw that again. video. Felix, you have got to be kidding me! Let's go, champ! not right this is not cool ah but this was actually a uh, so close one with t-series like that was so close just by a bit like PewDiePie had the lead for our time right and we were all thinking he was gonna win and then suddenly t-series got a few more but I feel like in the future like from the days to come like PewDiePie will have the lead if there's ever another challenge like that yeah most definitely this is not right, this is not cool, this is fucking bullshit. This yeah. is all wrong. Today, we will be planting 20 million trees. Oh. I'm trying to sneak around. And I what is that, guys? Ted Audio. He met a painful end right there. I the way he was sliding down those stairs with his butt sitting on his butt, like he must have broken a few bones. Like, after such a sliding, you're not gonna be alright. You need to see a doctor because if you're still alive, who knows? But yeah, that looked really, really painful, guys. Like, whew. To the amazing people we lost in. 2009. Hello, Bro Army. Don't act for hack here with another PewDiePie. You lost him? Oh, that's that hater boy! 
Yeah, this this guy is like crazy. Like I don't know, like what's wrong with that guy? But he just makes like a lot of videos hating on PewDiePie for for no real reason. Actually, he just wants that cloud, right? He's just cloud chasing or something. That's so crazy. In true fact, he loves him. I think. What is he drinking? A fine job. Make stuff you're proud of. That that what he was drinking from that jar. That doesn't look healthy, like... It looks like if you actually swallow that, you will make yourself shine from the inside, like you... You actually maybe see the organs, right? Like, if he's shirtless, maybe you see some glowing, like, there's the lung, there's the heart, there's the liver, there's the kidney, like... That's gonna mess up your organs, for real, like... It doesn't look healthy. You're gonna find job, make stuff you're proud of. <clears throat> My message to the youth is uh, to be strong no matter what you are. R.I.P. Juice World. If you want a professional help, seek help and you'll f surround yourself with people that will help you. Make sure that whatever life that you want, you strive for that shit. You make sure you go for that shit. Don't let anyone tell you it's not possible. Don't let anyone tell you that it's not practical. The drive you need to get it, you pull that from yourself. Because when you pull it from yourself, no one can influence it. No, but that's actually really true. If you have like a goal in life, right? Like you need to go for that goal, right? Like no matter how hard it gets or maybe you're not successful at the beginning, you need to keep striving and never give up. If you're patient and you keep you keep achieving your goals then, right? You're just going to be patient. Like I give you guys an example. You want to let's say start your own restaurant, right? And you're like really broke and you just graduated from let's say high school or something. And you just start saving some money, you get some ideas, you take some cooking lessons, right? And in the meantime, maybe you're doing another job or you're working as a waiter or waitress or something, right? And then you just keep saving money, you keep learning how to cook. And one day you have enough money saved to buy actually a place and to cook there and serve customers, right? So it's really about that and being patient. Like that's for real. But one thing I'm actually going to look up, because those are people we lost in 2019. And I'm actually sure the first guy we didn't lose, Dylan the, the Hacker. I'm pretty sure he's still alive. Let me Google that. Dylan the Hacker. I don't think he's dead. Oh, he really died. There's no way. Okay. Wow, so it, it really happened. Uh, actually, Dylan the Hacker really passed. At first I thought like, that was just a joke because he's like, PewDiePie's Spice uh, enemy number one, right? So something happened to Dylan. What happened to him? Does anyone know what happened to him? You can leave in the comment section. I'm pretty sure this guy is st still alive, but apparently he's not. Like, what happened? Like, that's crazy. Like, I'm sorry. Like, wow. R.I.P. That's sad. Or back to memes. We must stop the glorification of violence in our society. This True. includes the gruesome and grisly video games. That's true. Tetris is a gruesome, a very horrible uh, video game. It can make you become violent and, I don't know, maybe go out there and do crazy stuff. Like, for example, you want to go shopping and then you have like the shopping bag, right? And you just pick the product you want and you actually line them up like Tetris blocks in your bag. And it's so dangerous because it will make your bag heavier and you maybe end up hurting yourself or others from carrying a too heavy bag because you put in everything you buy like Tetris stones to get the maximum volume out of your shopping bag and that weight can lead to danger, right? <laughs> What's that? Oh wow, Sonic! Yeah. That was quick. 
Steve. Oh, Steve. Baby Yoda. I love Baby Yoda. So cute. Like, really. Also, a real famous meme. Like. <laughs> That's so crazy. Steve. Creepy. Oh, man. Oh, Donkey Kong. I used to play that game a lot when I was younger, like. Yes, we did it. I must say, I really love the way PewDiePie edits his videos. Like the way he just mixes stuff together and stuff. Like, really, really well done. Wow! Meow. Meow? What meow? Is that the bite of 87? What the heck? That was too heavy. Over on Twitter, you guys voted for the gaming tweet of the year. Okay. Cyberpunk. But <laughs> before how that guy's face changed. First he sees like the, the trailer of Cyberpunk. He's really excited, like he's smiling, he's so happy, like, ah Cyberpunk. Oh, I can't wait to play that, right? He's like that, right? Like that's why he's smiling here. He looks like so happy and all. And then there's some sort of makeup tutorial, and then he suddenly so concentrated. Uh, this, he looks like, hmm. Should I also apply it on my face like that? Maybe there a little. Maybe there a little. Hmm? Do I do it correct at home? <laughs> kind of like that. <laughs> like seriously, guys. But before we continue the video. Have you heard of an amazing free-to-play MMORPG PvP for your phone? It has over 5 million downloads and is number one on the Google Play. Oh wow. Just disappeared. Do you agree with our top 10 picks? Let us know in the comments below and check out all the creators in this video in the description. <laughs> I really love that planet animation they're going on in the background and it's just so crazy what you can do with a green screen. Like I should get a green screen as well. <laughs> it looks so interesting. Can't wait to see what you do next year YouTube. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm also excited for this year what will happen in 2020, right? Wow. Yeah, that's actually really, really good. I can confirm this now. YouTube Rewind 2019 is really, really good. Like, we had a lot of interesting memes here from anime to Naruto and, and Minecraft memes. And, and of course, the strongest this ever, then I mind your mom. Like, oh, wow. And yeah, like, I actually did notice with Dylan the hacker. Like, I'm so curious, like, what happened to him? Because, like, apparently it's confirmed that he passed in the news, but it doesn't say why he died, right? Like, what happened? I actually feel like deep inside his heart, Dylan the Hacker was a good guy. He just wanted some love, I feel like. And that's why he came at PewDiePie, just to get some love, right? Like, I'm sorry for the family and, I'm, and like, for the loss and everything, if that's really true with Dylan the Hacker and... Yeah, now I can confirm those YouTube rewinds by PewDiePie to 2019 were actually really good, really fun to watch, very entertaining. And I really love the way PewDiePie edits his videos or whoever edits them for him. It looks really, really dope, really, really cool. Like I really, really, really enjoyed this one. I hope you guys enjoyed this one too. See you guys next time.